Hey, good morning. What's up, guys? This lighting is trash. Give me a sec. Hey, what is up, guys? Today's a new day. I hope you're having a great day. Work towards your goals, being productive, and absolutely freaking crushing it. Today, we're going to the farm again. You guys haven't been there in a vlog since, like, forever ago because I don't even have a car so I can't go there by myself. We got all the stuff that we need almost uh, so that I can run my lathe and actually make something today which is kind of what I want to do. I just I want to get most of my parts of the lathe together so that we can actually use it. Oh guys it's a fire truck. Kind of having some trouble finding this. I found it. It's, uh, it's right under the. Here we go. Hi, Gaul. Alright, get. Hey, all right guys, we literally just made it to the farm, got the Tims, and I told, well actually I didn't tell Dad, I was sharing the video, the donut video with everybody, and uh, Dad's watching it right now, way out here at the farm, like he's he's sacrificing his dad to watch this video. That is how good this video is. You guys have to watch it if you have not seen it already. Please go and watch that video. I will link it right up here on the screen, and also the first thing in the description will be that right there, the link to that video. Please go and watch it and share it with just a couple people. It really does boost the algorithm if people share the video, so just, just hit the share button on the watch page. Just text it to your friend or something. Thank you guys. All right, let's go and get this chuck on my lathe for the first time in, I think, forever. And the lathe is right here. Oh yeah, sweet, she didn't even rust, eh? Guys, this lathe didn't even rust. I put the oil on it last time I was here. It's almost all still there, and there's no rust on this. It's beautiful, so I'm gonna make sure that I oil the ways before I leave. This machine is looking. <clears throat> yes, all right, all right, we need the ram bar. Where did I put the ram bar? Uh, big wrench, tail saw. Um, hmm. Ah, there she is. Oh, lovely. Oh, this is perfect. This stays on my lathe perfectly. I love this. This, that's staying right there. Mm. So guys, yesterday in, I believe it was yesterday's video, but I was in the wood shop for the first time in quite a while and I was using a lathe that is actually identical to this one. So that is like, it's, this is my favorite lathe. It's like a 19, 1968 Rockwell 16 inch gap bed lathe so you could turn something that's 16 inch diameter because you can go eight ways eight inches away from center right here and eight inches up here so you could turn a 16 inch plate basically or a bowl that's narrow and then this is just 12 inches over here so you could go i believe six inches away from center so you could turn something that's 12 inches round that's what 36 39 inches long because You've got this entire uh, length right here, so the end of the piece could be down here, and you could turn a baseball bat on this, basically. So this is what you call a lathe, and I'll show you how it works in just a sec. I'm going to turn some stuff, or you probably you probably saw my other video, and then you'd already know. 
Honestly, this is just the first time I've been down here in quite some time, and this is like the first time I've even had my lathe, even seen my lathe in like five or six months. So it's it's good to see it again. I love this lathe. I bought it for like $450, which was an absolute steal. Like this thing's worth, if you bought it reconditioned, it's probably worth about 1500. So like I definitely got a great deal on this. I Man, I absolutely love this lathe. It's gonna stick with me probably for the rest of my life. It's gonna be in every shop that I'm in. It's just an amazing tool and I even, I won this in a contest on a different YouTuber's channel. So I, I won that from my DIY channel by entering a giveaway. It was, it was awesome. It was supposed to be a scroll saw, but I already have a scroll saw and I don't really like scroll saws. So Record Power actually sent me this lathe chuck right here. It's a beautiful thing. It's an absolute beautiful thing. oiled up but it's not gonna rust now. All right guys, I literally just packed up the lathe. She's back to normal just the way we, I normally leave it. Out of all the elements, we got all the stuff and I'll show you what I made uh, a little bit later. Also, dad just remembered, we need that lamp and the blue one. We need both of them. That's the one that we bought with Stoop and then the blue one is the match to the alligator light. Ben had the blue one, and, or I had the blue one and Ben had the alligator light when we were kids, but I mean, I don't think he has a use for it now, so I'm just gonna cut it up and stick it to an ink lamp like the other one. Lighting goals. Also, check that out. Canadian flag. I need one of those for my basement so that I could put it up because we, we are Canadian. Guys, I, I, I have my entire camera, the big camera, up on the end of this tripod right now. That's why it looks so cool. But it's also really heavy and I don't want to break it. Video's got 222 views already. That donut video, that donut video we were talking about. Uh, so this battery was fully charged and it says it's empty. So maybe you should just buy Canon batteries. Anyways guys, uh, I'm editing that video right now and I realized that I did not film an outro for that video. So thank you guys so much for watching. This is the end of the video. If you guys are new, please subscribe. If you're already subscribed, please share this video with a friend. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, give it a big old thumbs up. We'll see you guys all next time. Peace out.